Hi everyone, my name is Fan, this is Lance, and this is Rich. Today we'll present our application, Mem2D. So what is Mem2D? Mem2D is a mobile information retrieval system for college students. Unlike existing solutions, we allow users to easily look up and share events by simply scanning a 2D barcode. Now Lance will tell you how Mem2D has helped Sarah and Steve. Hi everyone, I'd like to introduce you to Sarah. Sarah is a 21-year-old college student. She loves to hang out with her friends, but like most college students, she has a really hectic schedule to deal with. Now, as Sarah's watching, walking down the hall, she often sees bulletin boards like this one. Now, she'll see a few events on these bulletin boards that she'd like to attend, but Sarah doesn't have time to write down all the information, and she has a lot on her mind. So this is quite a lot to remember as well. How do we help Sarah? That's what Steve is thinking about. Steve is the class of 2009 social chair. Now, he has a lot of information to put on his event flyers, but he, wants to, he knows how busy Sarah is and how much she has on her mind. So he wants to make it more memorable for her. So let's look at the event information for the MIT Fall Formal. As you can see, this is a lot of information. It'd be hard for anyone to remember this, and it's a lot to write down, too. And Sarah, she has a lot on her mind. She has a microeconomics test, an essay. There's not a lot of room for the fall formal here. <laughs> so let's see what we can do about that. Enter MEM2D. It's a memo on the go. With MEM2D, Sarah simp Steve simply goes to the MEM2D website, and he gets a two-dimensional barcode. He places that barcode onto his event flyer. Then when Sarah <coughs> passes by the flyer, she scans it with her phone, and she instantly gets the event information right there on her phone. MEM2D does all the work for her. So let's see all of this in action with a demo. So on this screen, we'll see what Steve is doing. Steve goes to this page where he can create his event and begins to type in the information. Let's skip ahead to where he's typed it all in. Then he clicks on the Create Event button. <laughs> and he's taken to this page with his event barcode which he can then place onto his event flyer. So here's his event flyer. Now he's just going to go over to his, the bulletin board, like he normally would, and place it over here. <laughs> <laughs> now let's see what Sarah does. So today Sarah walks by the bulletin board, and she sees the poster for MIT Fall Formal. She recognizes the 2D barcode on the poster, and decides to use the Mem2D application to save this event onto her phone. So she goes, goes up to the bulletin board and focuses the camera on the 2D barcode and clicks scan. Now the application is decoding this uh, 2D barcode and retrieving the event information onto her phone. Now we'll show you what's happening on her phone. So she can view the information for the event, the description, as well as the map location for this event. Now she wants to RSVP for this event, so she cl clicks on RSVP. And now RSVP is complete. She thinks that her friend Adam will also be interested in, interested in this event. So she goes to the share page, selects Adam from the contact list, and clicks on email. Now this email invitation has been sent to Adam. While she's doing all of this task on her, on her phone, she's already on her way to class. Without Mem2D, she will have to stand by the poster, write down this information, and later go back to email to RSVP, and send another email to tell Adam about this event. Now she can do this simply on her phone with a few, little, few clicks. Now, Adam, now Lance will continue the story with Steve. Now Adam wants to know who's RSVP for his event. So he's on his event page, so he simply refreshes the page, and he sees that Sarah has RSVP'd for his event. Now, we've seen what some of the features of MEM2D. Now let's see the additional features. MEM2D also allows you to integrate with your mobile calendar. So you can add the event directly to your calendar from the MEM2D application. You can view the location of the event using the map screen. You've seen it RSVP, and you can share it both via email and SMS. Now Rich is going to tell us how MEM2D's architecture is set up.
So MemTD uses a pretty simple client-server model. Right. On the server side, there's a database which basically contains all the event information. So whenever someone goes to memtd.com, you create the event, and the event data, along with the generated barcode, will be saved to the database. And whenever you scan the barcode using our memtd application, this is also where the database, I mean, this is also where the data will be retrieved from. And on the application, there's also a mobile events database, which contains all the information you have retrieved from scanning barcodes. <coughs> Notice that also, even if there's no internet connection, at the time that you are scanning a barcode, the, the scan of the barcode will still be saved to this database, and whenever, whenever there is internet connection available, our application will sync in the background with our server seamlessly. So what have we gained with MIM2D? With MIM2D, we have a simple and convenient way for event managers to get their information to the people who are attending their events. Sarah simply scans the 2D barcode, and the event information is on her phone. Mem2D handles all the work for her. So with that, we'll take any questions.